Nirman Sadastra has been farming seaweed here for more than 20 years. It's hard work and it always has been. But now his crop is being put to a new use, creating environmentally friendly bioplastics. The seaweed grown here on Nusa Penida, an island close to Bali, could eventually be turned into biodegradable packaging. The sea itself may hold the solution to the plastic that blights it. Yeah. Kami setuju sekali kalau rumput laut ini diolah untuk menjadi plastik. Apalagi kalau sudah diolah menjadi plastik cukup ramah lingkungan ketimbang plastik-plastik yang sudah ada itu yang menimbulkan polusi terhadap lingkungan. The problem is especially pressing here. Indonesia is the second biggest plastic polluter in the world after China. And farms like this are under pressure. There used to be hundreds on the shores of Nusa Penida alone. But more and more, they're being redeveloped for tourism. This is a small farm. It's the last farm on this island. And the technology isn't commercially proven yet. The problem it's up against is huge. But perhaps this is the start of something. Here's what that seaweed looks like turned into biodegradable plastic. Unlike normal throwaway sachets, this packaging dissolves in water. If we cannot do this all by ourselves, we are not Superman, right? We need uh, to engage like everyone from the government sector, private sector, or like end customers. Because like by doing this together, I think we can really solve uh, the problem because it's a huge problem, it's everyone's problems. Earlier this year, a British diver swam head first into that problem. I was swimming under it. This, this swim probably took me five or ten minutes. Really? Yeah. <laughs> It's, yeah, it's probably hundreds of kilograms yeah. of it on here on that day. This massive plastic cloud formed off the same island where seaweed farmers are growing their crop. It was full of all kinds of waste. Plastic bags, cups, wrappers. They don't biodegrade, so this slick will just drift and drift endlessly through the ocean. Uh, each, each wet season from November until so April, May time, uh, you'll see clouds going past, and we've just seen more and more clouds, and then bigger clouds of it going past each year. So it is getting worse every single year, definitely. Weed by weed, Neumann is toiling towards a more hopeful future. When you live and work here, in the space between the land and the sea, the distinction between them becomes much smaller. Making a start on the problem matters a lot more. Tom Cheshire, Sky News, Anusa Penida, Indonesia.